Welcome back to Elden Ring, Shadow of the Erd Tree. There's the Shadow of the Erd Tree. The new tree. Here's the shadow of this tower. Also, roots and something. Going up to the shadow tower. I'm sure, there's gonna be a giant mess up there. So, how about we get a level before we leave? You know, there are 16,000 runes here. Doable. Worth it. <laughs> Let me make that happen. Here's 12,500. There's a few more after that. Went over. Just make games of the runes take slightly longer, but that's alright. Like, what, 4,000 ish? That's probably fine. A few hundred runes isn't really that big of a deal. A few thousand runes, not really either. That's okay. More dexterity? We're not getting a boost to right arm at 1 there. We're getting to 47. Two, three, one, two, three. What's our right and left arms here? Check the equipment. This is right one, two, three. That's our cold dagger. Switch that back up for the Jubia. That'll well, give us the actual information. So it's right one, two, three. Left one, two, three. I don't really use these. Probably take these off. It's either going to be bleed or death. We got some kind of elemental thing going. We could definitely have that available. I this we could wear heavier armor if we wanted to. None of it looks too clean with what we're currently going with though. So It's all about style here too. <laughs> Which is definitely a choice. <laughs> we'll level up. There's some XP. Now we have nothing in the two slot. Let's just give in a few more damage. Anything else we really want? More FP. More stamina could be good. Our stamina's fairly low. I'd go for some more endurance. It'd also give us some more equip load if we want to put on some really heavy stuff. It's just like two stamina. It all adds up. We can definitely put a lot more points into endurance, gain more value out of it. Arcane would be two damage there. This is one damage and two damage on the offhand, essentially. Her. Yeah. More strength also gives a little bit. Let's wield other stuff too. Endurance. I think a little bit of all of them. This stuff's like 50 or something. We're just gonna keep getting levels here. I'm sure everything out of the DLC is gonna be very significant in the runes department. Well, I'll do nicely. Alright. Let's get up to whatever this mess is gonna be. Also, not having the second set of weapons allows us to switch between these more easily. So that's also nice. Oh. Endless Death Pit? Endless Death Pit. A classic. A classic. And we'll return the elevator. In case we want to go back this way. Due to our unfortunate deaths. <laughs> Alright. What kind of mess we got going on up this way? Likely tree. Tree over there. Thoughts mess. Oh, sl maybe slightly more thorny here. This guy's concerned. I'm concerned too. Let's be honest here. Yeah. Seems familiar. Alright, we got an item. Tower of Shadow message. Alright. Tower of Shadow. Love it. Message left for the author's compatriots. Message left by Needle Knight Letta. I think that was the person we talked to outside at the start. Addressed to kindred spirits who also pursue Nicholas Trail. The gate of divinity lies in the tower sealed by shadow. That is surely where kind Nicholas is headed. We are no Empyreans. We must locate the path that will lead us there. I'll follow the crosses east. Okay. 
This is the gate of divinity in here. Let's locate the path that will lead us there. Sealed by shadow. That's where Michael is headed. We can't get in here right now, possibly. Sealed by the shadow. Sealed by and obscured by shadow. I hear shadows. Why is it always you don't have the right? <laughs> always a detour. You don't have the right. <laughs> Dang. All this effort to get up to the shadow place here. You can't just go around either. <laughs> Interesting. So we were following the path, essentially, with all the little gold markers here. Well, one here. I guess one here. Now, nothing. Hmm. Wild. We'll try to jump on the shadows. Seems like a safe idea. Just, just climb up. It's gonna be fine. Jumping required. Liars. <laughs> Alright. So we gotta deal with this in order to continue that way. Yeah, there's this other spot right here. Or something. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is cross. Exactly where this one is. It's not on this ledge here or anything. Further down this way. Hmm. I thought I came across this. Is it on the map? What if I put it here? See the beam? Beaming from there. I don't see any cross in the sky here. How suspect. How peculiar. Let's see if I can find what this is referring to. There's this crazy guy in here, though. I'm just going to make our way past here. Where have he gone? I'll be okay with that. Oh, there he is. Leave it. Can't stop me. <laughs> Could be on a lower level or something. Is it right here? Somewhere? <laughs> bases of these crosses before. I'm just going to climb up here. It's not in here. Can't look at the map in combat here either. It's unfortunate. Or something nearby. It's not really on top of here. Probably. Hmm. It's like a marker of where Nicholas is going. It's not a 
abundantly obvious here. How odd. Hopefully you saw that we were looking around earlier. Let's run away from all this nonsense right now. That's fine. <laughs> the nonsense has followed us. That's okay. You can't push a lot by just running around a bit. Yeah. <laughs> Rude. That's how I've been in this area. Those stripped of oh. the grace of gold shall all meet death in the embrace of Mesmer's flame. Fire Knight. Well then. Alright. Hey. Now. How'd you like some blood? around pretty effectively. Just randomly ran in my way to a new location. Wild. Did help me find this cross. It did help me find an area above where the jail is, I guess. It's not up there. The other ones have been pretty obvious in there. Being a whole giant big cross thing. How did we get there? We went down into the pit. Then we went around. Let's start from lower maybe. Let's start from the start. Try to figure out how to get back to that spot. Hmm. Very interesting. It feels like there is things to be s discovered here. I should just put the elevators back to the convenient locations. This is the good, good direction to go? Who knows? <laughs> Gets us somewhere, though. <laughs> Let's keep running around until we meander our way back in this direction, I suppose. It's also nice not having any ruins we're risking. That's a plus. Up in this area. Up, we went through there. Jumped. Right past some of these. Down this way. Down this way. Around through here. We got something going on here. That's for sure. So over this section. Fire guy head, indeed. I suppose we could prepare for this fight a little bit more. Might be a smart plan. Stripped of the grace of gold shall all meet death in the embrace of Mesmer's flame. Did 
You're not right now. You're not right now. Other guy in here. <laughs> here for a second. Get some distance so we can the flask. Now. And we should also heal. Shield again. <laughs> Fiery. It's kind of the whole theme for Lion's Guys. Can't dodge them all. <laughs> I should have invaded me. Rude guy. Anyway, that's a new something. Raises attack power after defeating an enemy. Tells him depicting a raised spear on a black drop of flames. Zones of the lives lost in the sacred crusade led by Mesmer. Raises attack power after defeating an enemy. Warriors who fought in the crusade set aside both honor and mercy to wantingly impale and scorch those deemed impure. Those who felt invigorated by each cry of death were the same men who were certain of the sanctity of the campaign. My goodness. A bunch of various increased damage things going on. I think enormously boosting our physical negation is still pretty good. Raise the attack power when HP is maximum. Also pretty good. Depends what the situation is, I guess. We're defeating a whole bunch of enemies. That one could also be good. Just break all of the graves here. We're a force of destruction here. Or their graves are just incredibly weak. Also an option. Hey. Okay. Very necessary. Very cool. Okay. Do jam. There is here. He's making a pile of rocks. He's having a good time. Anything else back here? This tree here with an item. Ash of War. Shriek of Sorrow. Let's see. Occult Affinity. Affiliate skill Shriek of Sorrow. Skill utilized by the downtrodden. Scream, causing nearby enemies to flinch, while also recalling deep seated resentment. Boosting attack power based on the amount of HP remaining. The lower the HP, the greater the effect. Usable on all melee armaments. So, that is a red tier stone kind of idea. Very cool. Lower the HP, the greater the effect. And I'm for this guy. Butterflies. Just chilling. Alright. Interesting little 
area we didn't find before here. So I kind of want to look to try to find this apparent cross here. It should be on this level. It really wasn't. The other crosses have had lots of noteworthy stuff at them. Should be pretty obvious. Is there a giant glowing cross? Those are some of the nun done though, apparently. Are they the base? Or are they more at the middle? I guess they're more at the middle. I guess it could be up in there. It's a little suspect. Oh, you were? Oh. oh, that's just a building. Almost looks like part of a staircase, but elevator or something. It's not them. I jump on this tree. <laughs> a little bit. No reason to then. Smashing some more of these. You have to hear. Here's an item. Okay. Ten arrows. Oh boy. Another spots like this. Also these walls. Something behind the walls. Are they in the walls? Probably not. Whole place is kind of a mess, honestly. Could this be a door? Unlikely. <laughs> this is just this section on the map. Lots of different levels and buildings and all that. I guess we do want the elevator here down. That's going to be the more important spot for that. So we don't currently have the availability to do much. I'm not saying. Is it really up here though, I don't think. This is here. Hmm. It's just going this way. Different outside section. I don't know if we can really exactly get to it exactly. Because it all looks kind of unfinished and stuff. Like the kind of out of bounds area you can't really get to. The big pit. And there is the outside of the arena from this side. Can't jump around these sections here. Jump up onto this. A little bit of floating going on there. Slightly concerning, honestly. I can break that. This is not the right way then. Side of this section. It's still part of the arena here, then. So down further, there's the bridge. There's a rooftop there. I can really get out to there, though. I'd like to. Tower required. Suspicious here. Any sense we can get off the elevator? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, this is this level. Got the stairs over here that didn't really accomplish much. 
First off, I did it. Praise the message. <laughs> Definitely did it. I jump on these. I jump on these. Now we're getting a little bit weird about it. I doubt we can jump out of the arena here. I'm pretty wild. Of course, I'm no master of parkour either, so. Never say never. Probably do say never, though, let's be honest. If I can jump on this, though, it's pretty funny. I don't think there's anything back there. I think I'd want to want maybe jump on this other side here. Need a run and jump, if possible. I don't think it's possible. But like I said, why not? Other back step. Jump, jump, jump. I've seen it already. Get, we kind of get stuck in the middle of the basket of the heads here. It's just kind of weird. Just gonna jump out of the heads. This is very, very futile. I'm aware of that. Okay. If we can get up to there, we can get out to this. Kind of sort of out of bounds section. You know if we can drop around here? I don't think so. Yeah, there's the top of that. We have 30,000 runes now. That's something. There's the bridge. That section. I think the. Yeah, this other outer area is over this side, so that's not where it is. Not like a lower section here or anything. It didn't disappear or something, did it? Let's see, in the middle, compare this. These guys are nearby it. It's kind of like alongside the road here. Depends on if the placement of the icons are relative to where they are in actuality. Which is also definitely a question. But look at this one. It is some ways this way. Also, some ways from here. But it's not like close to the middle here or anything. We stand on it, we'll see where our marker's at. Uh, it's more towards the bottom, honestly. Maybe not the bottom bottom. Nothing towards the bottom. There's all these buildings here. I don't think this is this. It's definitely, it's more of a direction. Yes, it's right there. There's no giant floating cross here. Man. How strange. Could be like an under level or something. Jump off of here. Risk of the scenario, we lose nothing. Ah, I got a kill point. Boo! Boo! Shame. 
Well, it's easy enough to get the runes back, so I'll take it. It's not like on the sides of the houses or anything here. So there's a cross here. I don't know. I don't know. Tree there. Hmm. If there's any giant, majestic crosses glowing, you'll see them. Definitely not, though. How strange. How very strange. We get, like, underneath, maybe? They're kind of, kind of the whole point is they're very large and very noticeable. This is nothing of the sort. What about this way? What if we talk to the maiden that was in here again? See how they think about how we've dealt with the situation <laughs> so far. And here. We're taking your silver horn tenders. of this side. Get to anywhere. Pressing forward through here goes the correct direction. Ostensibly. I'm gonna go out this way. Swords some more. <laughs> and here. <laughs> Don't look at stuff. Being very rude. Super threatening or anything. We went into there. It's not really on this level then. It's about down here. This keeps pushing us further up again. Past this level. I don't really have a lower direction here. Or maybe. Very big. You got here. Here, that's okay. Get some runes for efforts, too. Not that's worth anything. Here's these guys. It's just not. It's the thing. It's the waterfall section.
climb up that gets us to the middle here. It's really a conch, isn't it? Kind of over there with that. Pitwise down! Bird tank. Out of here. <laughs> Try to look at stuff. In there with those. Somebody jumping over there. Okay. Getting back to there. Went up. I saw it around previously. Let's see here. Is this out? Mage is attacking us. Appreciate it. <laughs> Still, huh? <laughs> Consider that rude. These bot guys typically have a bunch of stuff. So no jumping. It's over there. Kind of where I want to be. I fly guy. <laughs> This brings us up this way again. <laughs> so many different corridors and sections. Definitely quite a bit. Okay. I guess we'll find down there. Yeah, <laughs> of course he is. Instead of two there. Come <laughs> that guy because we can. Smith the stones. I'm only over here. There's definitely a way to be over there. We've been there before. Technically, we could go and look to see how we got over there before. <laughs> that is another option. Through a different passage or something. Not here. <laughs> I mean, kind of here. I got the night guy in the way over this way. A lot of this is unnecessary. Pretty much all of it. And then, <laughs> I'll be taking your stones. I'm trying to stop me. Drop down from right there. Possible. I have 66,000 runes here. That's not bad either. More levels is nice. It's always a good time. Right here. Here. 
through any of these windows. Okay, over this wall. I get the jam down. Can't really get over this wall though. That's where I want to be. <laughs> I mean, we don't need to be anywhere in particular. This is where I want to be, though. Around this building or something. Parkour off tiny ledges. If we did get up here, I don't think we can get around to that. It needs to come through from somewhere else. That's some futility is what this is. <laughs> Something weird about it. This way. Plenty of health. <laughs> Back behind something or something. Oh, grace gracefully we glide down these cliffs. It's right over here. It's gotta be. Here I can jump. Oh. <laughs> we managed to get to there from a different way. Uh. Mm. I'm just confusing myself. More than anything. <laughs> Wouldn't it be through the sewer? About me. <laughs> this is out to here. That's just all out in this mess. I think that gets me where I want to be. Somehow. Back over in the other side. Up here, this is this guy. This is the waterfall area. Here. It's like the pit. 
climb this way. It's like across, across here is also where it was at. So I managed to get across there. There's a that's a different way across to somewhere else. We dropped it off a roof to get to there. Damn it. We can't drop off that. Of we can't climb that either. Entrances, exits. There's this guy here trying to do stuff. Rude. Yeah. All these bonus Smith and Sins. I definitely managed to get over there before. He's got the thing that was there. There's a hallway that goes into that side. to here, which is not where we need to be, because we've never here before. Interesting spell, though. Nice. Stop being attacking me. I need to do stuff. Just go look back and see how we got there before. Now it's bothering me more than anything. It's like a path some other direction. Here to the left, then down, then in. Get out here. I don't think it was all the way at the start or anything. Maybe too early. Did you just fall off? Grumble, grumble, grumble. Alright, yeah, we're going to rest here for a second. Get all the aggro off of us, my goodness. I'm not sure if the mages and stuff. Over this way. This is too far away to be over here. Okay. What how I got into that room? I'm gonna go find out. I'm gonna go find out. Mm. Okay, yeah. We found it. Wasn't that impre was not as impressive as the other ones. In this one here. You go to the stairs, and then the bridge area above the pit, and then stuff. You guys never were using their magic before, that's pretty wild. Wild stuff out here. Anyways, go 
around these guys. Plus the big horned guys don't follow us more. It's through here. Up the stairs. To this bridges and pit area. Then this way. Past the little scorpions and stuff. And then behind all this. This is definitely a hidden location. Compared to some of the other ones. Attack them with my daggers. And all the fly mold we could ever eat. Delicious. We found one of the two tree fragments here. Yeah, it's right here. I abandoned here my arm. Sinistral. Okay. So I don't think we read the words because we didn't think this was. Uh, big, interesting one. I've been in here, my arm sinistral. Weird. Alright, so that is that. And then we went out here and got stuff here too. Then tried to look around if we could jump anywhere else, but we couldn't. Okay. Let's... How we got over here. Definitely plenty of hidden paths and such. So unfortunately, we can't do anything up here in the shadowy tower area. Although it looks like a giant mess where we might not actually have anything we can actually even do there. Depends how much shadow is going on. How we can deal with that. Yeah, we've been here. That was a bit. We did find something new, at least, over here. Which is kind of even kind of being covered by the jail marker from below here. This is Bellarith though, so. That checks out. We went outside, inside. I'd say we explore this area pretty thoroughly. Unfortunately, not into the shadows. That's alright. Like this said, in the note, we need to follow the markers the other way. We do still have the note of where some of the markers are at. Somewhere. Just a little map. There it is. The cross map. We went through the tunnel to that one, found another one up in the city. Now we need to cross the bridge and go to the other town area. Up in here. And also, everything else that's on the other side of this bridge. That poison swamp. And that will be the direction we're headed. Next time. Goodbye.